Tip of the week before we get into Archicad, this is something that I find uh, is always uh, somewhat uh, confusing to people when they first start to use uh, drawings on layouts, and um, is important to understand the proper way for updating and changing skills of drawings so that you um, you know can keep things consistent. So let me just first talk about this. So when you place a drawing onto a sheet or a view on a sheet becomes a drawing, um, then you know you at some point may want to modify the view settings. Maybe you want to change that drawing from uh, maybe quarter inch to eighth inch because it needs to fit on the sheet better. Uh, maybe you want to uh, increase its scale, whatever you want to do to that drawing. If you are, if the purpose of that drawing is to, um, uh, to change its scale, what you really want to do is you most likely want to modify the view settings as opposed to changing the drawing settings, which I'll talk about in a second. And what I mean by that is that you place that drawing onto a sheet. Now you want to modify its scale. So what you do is you select that drawing, you right-click it, and then you select Modify Source View Settings. And those will open up the view settings um, that you, you know, saved when you created that view. And then here you would go in and I would say, okay, I want to change this from quarter inch to eighth inch. Why is this important? Well, because when you change it from quarter inch to eighth inch, it's going doing it this way. In other words, um, opening up the view settings and changing it. Then the the as you can see, the drawing changes from eighth inch to quarter inch. But notice the text uh, stays the same size, so it's still at you know twelve point or whatever point we've set here. It's still the same point size for both. Uh, the uh, size of my symbols have also remained the same. Even though I'm at a smaller scale, it did not reduce the text size, it did not reduce the symbol size of my symbols, it kept everything the same. It simply uh, increased or decreased the um, uh, my view around those symbols. So this is really important because if you want to have an eighth inch drawing and you want that text to be the same uh, uh, for you know all of your drawings, whether the eighth inch, quarter inch, half inch, whatever, um, in terms of the font size, then you need to change it in the view settings um, and not in what I'm going to show you next, which is the drawing settings. We're going to talk about drawing settings that you can place a drawing and open it up and then change the um, settings. Well, that is because once you've placed that drawing and you open it up, you can then place change that scale here as well. So I place a drawing, its original scale with H was eighth inch. I open it up, I want to change this down to quarter inch or something like that. You can do that. However, here's what happens. If I change it that way, here's what that original quarter inch scale looked like, right? Well, now it's like I've taken it, I've placed it on, onto a, a Xerox or copy machine, and I've, I've now said that I want to reduce its scale by 50% to eighth inch, and now look what it's done to all my text and all my symbols. It has reduced the scale, which you can see just like the other view I looked at. It's reduced the scale, but my symbols now have also been reduced in scale. My text has reduced the scale. So everything in the entire um, view has been reduced by 50%, not just the drawing itself. Okay. So keep in mind, this might be helpful for certain things. Um, and there are places where it's, it, it's definitely useful to do it this way. But I want you to understand the differences. Most of the time, you want to just simply open up the view settings, change the scale there, and then that way the, the, the text and the um, symbols stay consistent throughout all of your layouts. There are instances where you do want to reduce uh, it by 50% for everything. But just keep that in mind um, as to where you want to, to do, do it that way versus not. Okay.